for right now, we want to get to some uh, guests we have in our studio with us here this evening. Welcome, fellas. Hello. Hey, thanks Hello. for having Hello. us. Howdy, howdy. And lady. She's back there uh, <laughs> taking video. <laughs> uh, we, we have in the studio with us tonight uh, the band Drop and Pick Up. And uh, you guys are a Tampa band. I can... Indeed. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. Mostly all living in the air area now. Yep, but, give or take the Greater Tampa area. Yeah. yeah, very good. And um, you've uh, you come, you all come from different places though, and you kind of just met down here and got it going. How'd that all? How yeah, we had a, Genesis. We had uh, two that were generally born and well, not born, but raised in Tampa, and then the rest of us are all about. Um, we got Chase is from Texas, Nick's from Pittsburgh, Dallas, and I'm from all over. Yeah, very good. You want to uh, take a second to introduce you so they know the name that goes with the voice and the instrument maybe that you My play? My name is Chase. I uh, play the bass. I'm from Dallas, Texas. Go Cowboys. Nick? <laughs> <laughs> I'm Nick Ewing. I play fiddle. I'm from Pittsburgh. I'm not going to talk about the NFL tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Believe me, we don't want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> if there's any Bucks fans out there, they know what I'm talking hey, about. Hey, USF beat the spread, okay? <laughs> they, they played a hey, better they game. Well. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm proud of them. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, they had me nervous at halftime, 7-7. Seven, seven. <laughs> uh, my name's Santino. I, I play electric guitar. I'm born and raised from Tampa, a part of the uh, Paragon Music family. Oh, That's very good. Cool. Paragon! Paragon! <laughs> nice. What's going on? I'm Denny Humphreys. I play drums for the band, and I'm from Tampa, Florida as well. Denny? My name's Mike Farrell. I play uh, vocals and some percussion here and there, and uh, I'm from Chicago, born... Nice. I live here. How long have you been down here? Uh, give or take eight years. Yeah. So we so, could take eight years? <laughs> so, how, <laughs> so how'd you guys how'd you guys all meet? Did you meet through a common bar you hung out in or uh, friends of friends or I think parts were uh, friends of friends, parts were also open mic areas and then uh meeting mutual acquaintances and saying, Hey you guys play music, let's get together and jam and then go from there. Right on. So it's a it's a collective kind of thing. Absolutely. You, you mentioned we've had players come and go. and Right. But you've kind of settled in on this lineup. For now. You never know what's going to happen in the future. You never know. Right. Sure. Like these guys are seeing this weekend, man. They, uh, well, the, the uh, consummate uh, show at Lockin this weekend, which also is kind of in this collective theory, was Tedeschi Trucks, you know. And so now they have okay. they had two bands, and then they've merged them into one band, and then they've added. There was like 20 people on the stage, man. It was crazy. They had that, five uh, backup singers. And- that, old, that old Tedeschi uh, album, Just Won't Burn, man, that was just incredible. That was so influential to me growing up, man. I love that album. Yeah, we were we were talking this weekend. We we're like, oh, we, I just I want some just Derek Trucks band back, man. That was good <laughs> stuff. And uh, Susan Tedeschi is uh, just wonderful. Incredible. And, yeah, she was. Um, she and Chris Robinson sang together on this uh, Joe Cocker tribute thing, and they both have these powerful voices, you know. And and then they have all the backup singers, and man, you get that just that rage of a uh, of vocalist. It was like you know everyone trying to one up each other, right. not one up each other, but you know like bring out the best in each other. Right. And it was uh, it was a fantastic sound. So <laughs> so you guys have a CD out. Yeah, it's called uh, Settling of Sorts. We released it back in October of uh, the past year. Mm-hmm. And it was our first CD. It took about a year to make and produce. But the songs were, um, over the past maybe four or five years, put together. So it's really been a long time. And we're really proud of this album. So Good. And you guys have uh, been playing it out a lot. I've seen, uh, seen you on a lot of bills. You've been at Skippers and uh, in and around town. So you, 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 the, the songs kind of uh, play themselves now. Yeah, to an extent, yeah, yeah. We've had to rework some with uh, new members and everything, but um, they still do their job. Yeah, very good. Well, let's sample a little of that, shall we? Absolutely. What's the t- tune we're going to listen to? This song is the uh, first one on the album. It's called Alexander Super Trent. All right, drop and pick up on In the Groove. My ghost cause I will need them. Let's hear the ball. 
drop and pick up there off of their inaugural CD? Absolutely. Yep. Oh, might want to turn them on. Yeah, that would be good. <laughs> yeah. Sound a lot better that way. That's our uh, first and only CD present time. Very good. Uh, good stuff. Good sounding stuff. So, um, you uh, you got some shows coming up this week. I know that's uh, that kind of got us communicating. Yeah, we got a, a we have a killer show in uh, St. Pete at Ringside Cafe, playing with Displace, Holiness Moly, No Need, Serotonic, and uh, DJ K Slat. Yeah, lots of good bands. Wow. That is a big show. <laughs> yeah. So that's Saturday or Friday this weekend? Saturday. 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 Okay. Very good. Saturday at the ringside, and then next week you're involved with uh, the birthday celebration. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah. Birthday. Can't thank, <laughs> can't thank, uh, can't thank uh, Skippers enough, man. They uh, they really treat us well, as do WMNF, and uh, we love them. Yeah, we, very uh, good, we love playing Skippers, uh, the, the best venue in town. Yeah, very, very much so. I think. Well, at least in Tampa, and you know, I love the ringside too. The new ringside, the old ringside was kind of cool, but it was that you know kind of dark corner, right. you know, right. sweaty little. It was there off Fourth uh, Street or something, yeah, right? right? Yeah. I think the first show I played there at ringside, they were still listed at that other address, and uh, so I showed up there, and there was yeah, an empty black. lot. There was nothing. <laughs> it, was just, it was just black there. So. Yeah. Yeah, uh, it, it, it was definitely set up as a blues club, nice and hot, and yeah, yeah. Just uh, you didn't want to play there in the summertime. I had one little uh, window air conditioner <laughs> for the whole thing. Yeah, it was a sweaty little thing, but they yeah. man, they had some great but, yeah. music come through there, and now they've got like a you know nice big stage and a killer venue. So yeah. that'll be they get that'll some be big good name time. Backs through there. Yeah, they do. Yeah, yeah right next to Janice. Great setup. Great yeah. setup. Yeah. And they have two first. In fact, I got some of that. <laughs> I was going to play in the uh, in the next half hour. I've got some of that Janice uh, Umphreys McGee show from back nice. in August. And then Displace did the after show with, right. uh, yep. with Roosevelt. So we'll, we'll get into some of that in the next hour. But right, right now, we're going to get a little live studio music. How about that, fellas? Yeah, Sounds great. All right. What are we going to hear here? This song's called Hunger.
So do you, are you mostly acoustic like that, or do you play electric and acoustic? Not generally. No, in fact, uh, I think we're all at electric nowadays, really. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so that's a nice treat to hear you kind of Yeah, and it was uh, quite a bit slower than it <laughs> yeah, typically much is. Yeah, much slower than usual. Yeah. Uh, which <laughs> I think a Are you, you okay, Mike? I'll be all right now. It's a little, <laughs> little tough to hold those high notes on the slow tempo there. No, it's very good, very good. Hunger, that tune was called. So. So um, how do you write? Do you write the do you write the lyrics first, and then the band play plays music, or do you get grooves going and then put lyrics to it, or how's that? Is it? It's usually a variety of uh, effects. There, it's sometimes it's the lyrics come first. Sometimes it's mostly the uh, I'd say mostly actually it's the instruments first because that that provides the the feeling the and the base, general yeah. atmosphere for the sound. Yeah. Yeah. Very good. And then uh, and then how about the name? How did you come up with the name? The name's just a really peculiar story. It was a uh, the actual original family members. It was me and my friend Milo, and he's no longer in the band. And we were, we were kind of opposites as far as dropping peg. But it was kind of like yin and, yin and yang. And uh, then as far as he had to plug in with his acoustic guitar into a dropping pickup. So it was just like some friends said, "Hey, why don't you guys call it a dropping pickup?" And we're like, "Ah, uh, sure." So I just stuck for a while and became what it is. Yeah, no, it's an interesting kind of uh, play on words in that respect, right? The Little entendre. Pickup truck or the pickup on the guitars. <laughs> right, 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 right. Yeah. right. 
We won't get into the whole dropping aspect. But, <laughs> <laughs> but no, that's a good ring to it. It's a, it's a, it's a cool name. Thank you. Very, uh, you know, sticks with you. Um, so uh, you've uh, we mentioned the two shows you got uh, coming up here. The one uh, Saturday night at the ringside and the one... Is it next Saturday or next Friday? It's uh, it is next Saturday. I yeah. think it is, yeah. Or is it, yeah, it's Friday, yeah, Friday, Friday, Saturday, 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 yeah, Saturday, Saturday. Yeah, okay. Fantastic. And then other things you got uh, planned for the fall? You got any, uh, are you going to... We're writing a lot of music right now. Um, we've got, uh, we, you know, we, we we got our debut album out now, and uh, we're, we're really, we've been writing that for a while, but uh, since the, you know, Santino's come on board and he's really helped uh, push a, push us in a direction that's uh a little bit newer to all of us and so that's really helping us um grow as musicians and then help uh, helping us uh write a lot as well which is really nice you know we, we've we've kind of grown even more you sure, know sure. so it's uh get, we're looking forward a little to more, the, get your creative juices the newer recordings Good. Yeah. So, you, are you in the studio at all with those yet, or are you still kind of just letting We're them grow still on stage? Last stuff, just yeah. demos and yeah, yeah. Yeah, because um, Santino's got a nice, uh, nice home studio, so we kind of record there and get an idea of where we want to go in the further process with the songs and how to expand upon them. So, yeah. very good. That's that uh, Paragon influence, right? That's yeah. right. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> Paragon music, Hillsborough Avenue. <laughs> oh man, that place has been here since I've been here. Yeah, that's, that's an institution. It is. Yeah. It yeah. is, man. Family-owned things are uh, really important to keep around. Yeah, yeah, and that's a Tampa-owned. Uh, you know, that's like a monument state. Yeah. You know, yeah, that's what I'm saying. For as long as I can remember, it's been there. So and that's been a while. Buildings have been cleared away from it, and it's still standing. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I, I, I live right around the corner from there. Yeah. Right on. Yes, sir. Cool. Well, you want to play another live one? You want to play one off the CD? What, what did you I'd say, because uh, our trumpet player is actually on the way right now, so I'd say go to a CD while we wait in the meantime. Okay. And uh, I'd say uh, Casta, which is number... Number six, if I'm not mistaken. Well, it's, it's a different uh, CD, though. Yeah. Uh, it's going to be number eight on the CD you have. All right. So, uh, and the name of the CD it's... was... <laughs> name of the CD is A Settling of Sorts. Settling of Sorts. And this is Castaway. Yes, sir. Drop and pick up on In the Groove. Hopefully.
groove off of their album Seeking of Sorts. The yeah, tune cast settling, settling of Sorts. Turn them That's on. That's why I can't. Yeah, oh. <laughs> I, it, I, this time I pushed the button up, but I didn't push the button in. So. We, we have to indoctrinate Thor That's after right. he's been away for a, a week or two. Yeah, <laughs> I lose my rhythm. <laughs> but uh, we're having a good time in here with all the guys uh, jamming us out. And uh, sharing their music, they've got uh, shows this weekend at Ringside, next weekend at Skipper Smokehouse, and um, they're just uh, full of good sounds and good music and good vibe, and so I uh, do appreciate you coming in here and sharing it with the audience Hey, tonight. thank you guys. Thank you, Thor. No problem. So um, so what else you got cooking? What else is uh, driving you guys these days? Are you traveling around much? You, we you... actually, I was going to talk about our October shows. October mm-hmm. 1st, we'll be playing at Rock the Park. Curtis Sixon, oh, really great. looking forward to that. We've been there once before, and it was a free true, show. It's yep. a free show, yep. and if it's uh, yeah, we can save the price on those shows. <laughs> yeah, it's <laughs> such a fun community event. It's always it really a pleasure to, yeah. get to be a part yeah. of them. I bring the whole family out there, and we spend a Thursday night and picnic. It's such a beautiful and, yeah. park too. It really is. Toss yeah. some disc around, hacky yeah, sack. It's just yeah. a cool yeah. urban vibe. And falls on its way, so it's going to be beautiful to go out there. No, no it's not. And you it's asked us if we're. <laughs> it's never going to. It's on its way. It's taking its time, but it's it's getting there. Yeah, October first, it'll be here. Yeah. Hopefully, but uh, on October tenth, we'll be actually traveling to Deland, Florida, a uh, place called Cafe Da Vinci. We really enjoyed playing at this festival up in Deland, North Florida. It was a phenomenal, phenomenal event. I can't remember the name of the festival. Deland Palooza. Deland Palooza. That's really hard to remember. <laughs> Hi, my name is Nick Ewing, and uh, <laughs> really looking forward to that. We actually have a party bus leaving from Tampa to Deland. I don't know if anybody is interested in going. We have tickets available. Nice. If you guys are excited to go, we'd love to have you. It is one heck of a trip. It's so fun up there and through, back. Contact you through Facebook? or you Contact website? through Facebook. Uh, we can also get in touch through the Facebook page, the website. Just to get in touch with us via the website, and we'll get in touch with you. What's that address? www.dropinpickup.com. Three Ws. There's an extra W in there. <laughs> well, but there's no G, right? No G. Yeah, it's D-R-O-P-I-N. Drop in. No hyphen. It's kind of complicated, but drop in pickup, two words, dot com. Yep. Very good. So yeah, that'll that'll be fun, um, especially if you can get a whole busload to go up there. And oh, it's always right? a good time. Oh yeah, we did one to Gainesville, and the video doesn't do it justice. We did a whole music <laughs> video for that, and it was truly on the fantastic. way up, the way back, oh, or the whole thing, both. Yeah, no, sure the, the way back, back. Would mostly be. the way back. Yeah, I was, gonna say, <laughs> I was gonna say the one way part back. that's a little funnier than the rest. Hey, so uh, I want to remind everybody you're listening to WMNF Tampa. 88.5 FM streaming here out of uh, Seminole Heights and uh, through the big antenna out in Riverview over to Lakeland, up to Spring Hill, down to um, Holmes Beach and uh, all points in between. Glad to have you listening here either through that airwave signal or streaming at WMNF.org. All over the world. That's right. And so you can, guys are like, you know. Worldwide. We're we're worldwide. Worldwide. Hey, we're 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 wide. 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 <laughs> Yeah, and of course you can stream this show and every show all week long till the next time it plays. So if uh, any of uh, the fans aren't listening here this evening, it'll be available all week until we hear next week. My mom will be playing that for her friends for, uh, you know, the next six days, I'm sure. Nice. That's good support right there. Yeah. <laughs> My mom's on the top of a hotel in Las Vegas right now listening to this, so shout there out to go. Mom. Mom all right. Right. right on. That's any more moms? All on red. <laughs> yeah. This all goes to our our ratings too, by the way. <laughs> all the all the all the hits on the week during the week goes to our ratings. So. Yeah, yeah. And then that's number what, one, that's what our paycheck is built off. Of. Yeah, that's, <laughs> <laughs> we have the number one jam band show in the in the state of Florida. Of course, we're the only jam band show in the state of Florida, right. so that makes us number one. But it works. That's yeah. right. Absolutely. Yeah. That's uh, insufficient competition. That's what it is. <laughs> all right. So. Uh, Shall we get back in the music? Yes, we shall. Ouch. Sorry. No, that's... no, it's the phone. Yeah. Yeah. I'd say let's play a song called Atlantis. And we'll keep an eye out for the door. We got one more. We got one more straggler. He's coming. He's going to be here soon. Yeah. He actually had a show him. until uh, 10 30. He's got to rush on over here. Nice. Make him wait a couple minutes. That's right.
slipping to little pieces So I can slip away, I can slip away I don't need to give you my reasons Wanna escape, I wanna escape The Lennox can hide, well then uh, so can I Won't be invisible, just in disguise I hope you never find me, I hope you never do Cause you got this power and I'll be through You hold me Tired, windy signal Recognize pain, do you recognize pain? Crying out the hole's getting bigger I can see day, the light of day The Lannis can hide, well then uh, so can I Won't be invisible, just in disguise I hope you never find me, I hope you never do Cause you got this power and I'll be through You hold me like one that can keep going for a little while yeah. days <laughs> we love to jam that one out when we can yeah yeah i can see that that one being electric <laughs> oh yeah certainly <laughs> certainly definitely well, very good guys i appreciate you uh coming in and sharing with the music with us tonight it's no, uh, thank you thor thank uh, you very much honestly it's always good to, stations uh, like you and people you guys that make this happen it's really yeah. incredible yeah we well, you know i i, I Listen to a lot of music. I see a lot of music. I wish I could play music. That's part of, I think, the attraction to people that can play music and make music. It's just that uh, the magic that goes with it. And I really think it's all, you know, it's all about uh, sharing that, you know, the interaction with the audience and just, you know, getting the getting the word out. There's, you know, I, I hear people all the time that are like, hey, there's just no good music these days. So I'm like, man, there there's a lot of good yeah, music. Yeah, there's these so days. much. You just got to know where to find it. You're, You're going to find it on the right spot. Commercial radio, right. You're. Not finding those clubs that you're going to, but uh, if you know where to find it, and uh, certainly here in the station is is what that's all about, then uh, then you can find music like this. So you got the squeaky chair. I know, man. I'm trying not to move so much. It's just it's, it's tough. It's a rocker, and I want to rock a little bit, you know. Yeah, they yeah. let you get the grease that way, right? <laughs> all right. So uh, once again, this Saturday ringside, next Saturday skippers. And um, for the big party, yeah, and yeah, October party time. 1st, Rock in the Park, yep, and uh, October 10th, the land, and some after that as well, yeah. Please contact us any way you want phone, email, yeah. That the land show is really gonna uh, be a big time. We got a party bus going out, we're gonna have a, 
a big time. Everybody's welcome. There's, uh, you know, you, you pay a couple extra bucks, but you get a free ride out there and a free ride back. So, uh, well, I, have know, as I, much I, fun as you want. Free. That, that, that's better than the, uh, the other alternative of getting a free ride back. Right. Exactly. <laughs> right. Back not to your house. <laughs> yeah. Oops, we made the, house. Hey, you know, you made the wrong turn. <laughs> well, cool. So, um, there, and there's a uh, sixth member of the band. It's a fluctuating seven or eight sometimes, actually, yeah. Um, we have a trumpet player that's on his way. You know, probably think of that door right now. And then a uh, backup vocalist named Gabby who goes to FSU, and she's she comes when she can. Right and she's brilliant, really. Truly really phenomenal. Her birthday is actually the same day as Skipper's on the 26th, so hopefully we can get her out there. Hope you're listening, Gabby. Everybody wants you there. Yeah, we'll sing happy fun. birthday to you, No too. pressure. No pressure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The whole world's listening right now. <laughs> no, that's good. It, like I, I was mentioning uh, about the Tedeschi trucks, you know, when you have those backup singers and just kind of gives that fullness to the Yeah, sound. it's the entire full sound. It's just yeah. empowering is what it is. Yeah, it's crazy. Man, old Derek trucks, man. He is killer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it was funny. Uh, we we were talking during the uh, Tedeschi Truck Show when Susan and uh, Chris were going back and forth on vocals. You know, then then Chris Robinson from the Black Crows. Right. So that they, and they were kind of singing back and forth, and then you'd, you'd see Derek over there, and he'd be like, "Don't forget about me." <laughs> and, uh, oh, like, man. Yeah. He he is just absolutely incredible. I'm sure Tino, you you probably. Uh, are in love oh, with yeah. you guys as much as I am, I'm sure. Well, oh, it's yeah. just so smooth, you know what I mean? It's, it seems like it's effortless and somehow... He, it's that you fuel know, thing you can't teach. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. And he, he just kind of takes you off. So he, uh, he's, he's taking that Dwayne lick and taking a little bit farther. Yeah. You know, makes you wonder. Yep. Makes yep. you wonder if he was still around. All right. We are... Javon's in the house. He made it. Ladies right. and gentlemen, Welcome, let's us introduce yeah. to you Javon Falcon. The man. Uh, hey. And this song is called It's In You. Yeah, he's the working man. Oh, so he's that one. And we're going right <laughs> yeah, into it right now. <laughs> There's no breaks around here. Set up here. Here we go. Thing I 
Thank you. Thank I think you. There was very many people sitting down in the studio during that. <laughs> Those are were word, not sitting still. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, uh, uh, let me remind you guys that, uh, or let me remind the listeners that you guys are on the uh, closing set for the birthday. Yes, we are. Uh, yes. Eleven to pace yourselves. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Twelve solid hours. So you guys are get the uh, the headliner more or less. Nice. So well, that's that'll you know tune like that'll get everybody cranked up. That's and we yeah. we always bring the energy. So uh, you know. And remind me of the name of that tune again. That it's song's called you. "It's in You." Yep. It's in you. Fantastic, and welcome, Giovanni. That was uh, Thank you. very nice. Awesome. That's the, yeah. The trumpet's a nice addition to that sound. Just like, like it's like almost it, mandatory. Yeah, yeah <laughs> I can, that's uh, good stuff. So this, yeah, this this weekend at the um, ringside, ringside. Yep, with uh, Displace and Serotonic and five or six, four, six, five other bands. Yeah, and then uh, birthday bash next Saturday, Skippers, and. Uh, uh, rock in the park. I want to say walk in the park. Rock yeah, in the park. Yeah. It's yeah. a walk in the park. Yeah. That'll be October 1st. So uh, plenty <laughs> of ways to see these guys. Uh, do get out and support live music. It's what uh, the station the show are all about. And uh, we appreciate you coming in and sharing with us. Thank you, guys, man. And, Thank you uh, guys so much. Since we can't let you just play one tune, why don't you take us one more tune on the way out? You got one more in Yeah, yeah. It's, uh, it's play Poseidon. Or you want to go out on that bang? Or you want to play a CD tune? Yeah. Uh, yeah, we'll play live. We'll say it when we're here. Might as well play live. Yeah, yeah. yeah the song's called Poseidon. I appreciate you guys uh, being flexible. You know, we couldn't get the live music studio, so we got, everybody, we got everybody in the air studio. We're having one big, uh, fun, acoustic, rock, and drop and pickup party. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
nicely done. Poseidon there from Drop and Pick Up Live on In the Groove. And uh, that'll uh, that'll keep you going there. And we want to thank you guys again for having us. Thank you so yeah, very thank much. Thank you so much. Thanks. Thanks. It was Thanks incredible. For sharing in the group with everyone tonight and uh, getting it all together. And thanks for making the, the, the early entrance, the late entrance, and <laughs> middle entrance. Yeah, for the, the uh, all the energy in the room. It was really fun. So Saturday night, ringside this weekend. Saturday night, skippers next weekend. Next weekend. Yep. Yeah, the park October and, uh, 1st. Keep your eye out. Drop and pick up. D R O P I N P I C K U P. Thanks again, We very much appreciate it, yeah, man. Yeah, man. All right. Thank you.